three days later. So I got to tell you, the whole filtering business that I was doing, fuck that. It was nonsense. Uh, it took 12 hours for that to filter. And then I just said, fuck it. Um, chucked it back into a jug of fresh water like this. Uh, slurred it around till it looked like that. And then poured off as much as I needed to. Stopped as soon as I started to see that I might be getting some solids passing through. Added water. Uh, fresh water stirred up again and just kept washing it that way. Finally, it got to, uh, it got to, I had a really clean uh, solution above uh, the shit that had settled out. So this is what I ended up with. Um, this is wet Harmala Hydrochlor, or not Harmala Hydrochlor, this is Harmala Freebase. I'm sorry, getting ahead of myself. And it just looks like a lump of clay. But, uh, I'm going to go ahead and convert this stuff into acetate and then add some salt water to, pre to precipitate uh, the hydrochloride form. It's pretty simple actually. Um, let me give you a little peek. I have, here's a little fragment of the freebase that dried some more, dried a little bit more than the rest of it had. A little piece was on the edge of the filter. Let's we'll see if we can get a look at it. Um, I don't know how well that's going to work. Maybe if I get right on that fucking thing. That ain't it. No, that might be the best it's going to be. Um, doesn't look like shit to me. I can see it with my naked eye. Of course. Anyway, so what I got here is, this is uh, about one part, 5% vinegar, and then three parts hot water. And this right here is just plain hot water. And I've dissolved as much salt into that shit as she'll take. There's still just a little bit of salt swirling around at the bottom. And these were heating up together in the same uh, hot bath in a pot on an electric stove. Um, so what I'm going to do is just go ahead and oh my god, oh, drop that fucking Harmala turd in there. I'm not going to be too picky with it, but I would like to get it off my fingers. Off the neck. All right, I've created a monster. Okay. Um. The idea is to get that all mixed up, but. It really doesn't feel like it wants to mix up that well. No, it's, it's going. It's going. The idea is, see, I, I filtered this shit and then I rinsed it because it was it was in a really basic solution. So I rinsed it, rinsed it, rinsed it, rinsed it, and the idea was to. Uh, was to get towards a more neutral pH so that I could uh, so that I could actually acidify it with some vinegar without using like a fucking ton of vinegar if you know what I'm saying because yeah it was it was really uh, it was really really basic um, so we want to make sure that stirred up really well. That's probably as good as I can ask for. Oh, I really need a different light. Oh, I can 
still see a little bit of something floating around in there. But that's all right. There, there may still be uh, little hunks of this, that, and the other in there. Um, like I said, this is a process, and it gets more pure each time. And there may still be, uh, there may still be like some fats or whatever from the uh, from the seeds, the starting material. Seeds are pretty fatty. I'm just gonna go. Oh fuck! All right, I guess I got enough room for that. I would have liked to have had a little more room in here, but I just added some more vinegar because I wasn't sure it was acidic enough because I don't have a, a pH tester. So I have to kind of do everything by color. And that's, I mean, it's all right, it works, but it's not ideal. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and add some of this, some of this warm saline, like a bunch. And then we'll see if we can get it poured off without making a huge mess. I'd like to get I'd like to get enough in there that I can make sure I get the reaction I want. I I, I really don't know what the what the correct proportion is. I mean, I can look it up, but generally I go like for as much as much solution as I just put as I just made with the with the harmala mud and the vinegar and the water. Uh, I try to do a third of that by volume of a strong saline solution. See, I'm thinking that this schmegma right here is probably fatty crap. But in any case, not gonna worry about it. So yeah, that, uh, it was really kind of interesting actually because I, I was trying really hard to get the shit to filter and uh, I was having no fucking luck. I tried it with the, uh, I tried it with the uh, the coffee filter, and that was fucking bullshit. So I tried it again with a piece of flannel, with this piece of flannel right here. And uh, this usually works really well for me. I can double it up or whatever. Fuck no, it wouldn't go through that either. And it was because it was so basic. It was like almost fucking thick, soapy solution. So I really had to rinse it. And if you've ever like, uh, you know, like uh, say if you're going to boil up some rice. Uh, I'm a bachelor and I don't have a steamer. So I just fucking boil it, right? One part rice, one part water. Psh. Um but, uh, but, you know, you, you want to rinse your rice first, so, you know, you dump some water in there and swish it around and dump it out. And you, you're, not careful, you're not carefully getting every drop out and struggling to keep those grains of rice from falling down the drain. You just pour out enough, put some more water in, right? Do that a few times until the water runs clear. It's basically the same thing with, uh, with decanting and settling this shit uh, as opposed to filtering it. So it was a real fucking nightmare. Um, so this is going to stand now. And as it cools, the uh, as it cools down, uh, it becomes less soluble in water. The harmala becomes less soluble in water. It it'll convert from harmala acetate into harmala hydro hydrochloride by picking up a chloride ion from the salt, some shit like that. I'm not a chemist, but that's that's the line I've been given. So, um, if, if I was really cool, I could set up a time lapse, but if you look real carefully, you can see Little spots where crystals are starting to form. This flashlight sucks ass. Anyway, so that's what's going on with that. And um, 
hopefully this is going to do what it's supposed to do and uh, and then I'll have a dish of uh, harmala hydrochloride and then I'll be able to uh, to turn it back into harmala free base again in the next purification step but it gets kind of uh, repetitious at this point but I gotta go I'm fucking sweating my ass off it's hot in here later